Alright, I'm back more City Skylines, and there's a few things I want to take care of today. One, this garbage thing, this incineration plant is going to be moved to here. We're going to make a little bridge over like we did with this side. Don't mind the floating trees. And uh, I'm probably just going to let these be filled and stay filled and not worry about them for a while. Thank you for telling me I had them too, the water pumps too close to that. I will move them up here in a second once I build this thing. Now here's the thing. Am I able to lift this up over or do I have to do it down here? I think maybe doing it here would help. Yeah, because I think I'd be way too close to the highway. Okay, we don't want to get rid of that. But it looks like we can figure out a way how to get them over there at least. Hopefully. Okay, so bring that down. And over. So like right there. Good enough. Uh, these can just be solved with a simple crossing. So yeah, we're going to relocate this one. Nope, do not want to do that. Does this relocate? Yeah, relocate it. You know what, well, let's pull that road out a bit more. Actually, where does that line up to with this? Alright, so like right about to, to here. Ish. Because eventually we could connect these up and have like a huge section of industry uh, repair stuff for... What am I talking about? Nope. There, that is relocated. Now we're going to stop emptying this. And if they get filled up, they get filled up for now. So, I'm going to relocate this as well. I would like to just have it maybe like right here. And relocate this as close as possible next to it. And now let's connect up these pipes. Which we can just do from here. That also needs electricity. God damn it. Okay, so we gotta just pull that in slightly. And pull this over here. Fixable stuff uh, we could always come back to and change. But let's see if that solves our problem. Hopefully. How many trucks are you sending out? Oh, you don't have water. Well, now you do. Enjoy. Also, don't they produce electricity? So I might as well just uh, connect these up. Yeah, I think they do. Yeah, that went up a little bit. Every little bit helps. How many are working here? 13 to 27. 12 to 27. Why are you not using all of them? That's what I'd like to know. 26, 27. There we go. Garbage problem getting solved. Put that down to one because the game gets a little choppy down there. See, we're having another death wave. That's nice. I've noticed this section I've made terribly because <laughs> he has to go all the way around just to get the garbage there. So that's kind of unfortunate. God, what an ugly mess this is right here. <laughs> so we'll, we could always fix that later on. Uh, but one thing I wanted to do today as well was connect up this road to there. Just with a straight shot over. Connect it up. But I had an idea for later. I want to turn this. I want to raise up the terrain in the middle of this as long as it doesn't flood the water that way. And put an airport here. Right in the water. I think that would look nice. Because, you know, I was thinking maybe we could put the cities around it. But no, let's put an airport here and let's have, like, some tourist attractions along the sides if we want to actually go there. What is that? Why is there a random cemetery here? That's really creepy. Alright. Uh, yeah, what was I going to do? Connect up the roads? Yes, exactly. So if we go to this... The magical rocks are here again, I see. <laughs> Fucking hate those things. Straight shot. How much did that even cost? A lot of money. 
Yes, I want it curved, absolutely. That's the thing with the train tracks. What if I lifted these over the train tracks? That'd be something different. Like right about here-ish. And just line it up. Again, with something we can fix with uh, if we mess it up or something. No big deal. It's not the end of the world. Although I am trying to line this up. And I'm glad they have that, unless that's the mod that I added in. Either way, it's a it's a godsend, seriously. Thank you to either the developers or whoever put that in there as a mod. Alright, so let's just drag this up. Like right about here-ish. Just so we have a, an idea. Oh god, I really gotta get rid of those trees. Just so we have an idea of where we want to place this road connector. Let's get rid of these trees. All you floating trees, you gotta, you gotta go. I'm sorry. It's getting on my nerves. Seeing that every time I zoom in. But what kind of connector do we have? Three-way? Or four-way? I'd say three-way, because having a four-way one would be kind of pointless. Although... Nah, three-way, because I could always bring something off down here. Connect up if I want to. What is that? That's a nice little connection. Hmm, that could be useful later. I didn't notice that was there. I really just like how this one looks. I think we're going to go with that one. So we're going to delete some of these roads. It's a decent chunk. But we should be able to get something in there. Angled into this road that we want. Something like that, I think. Because we can always curve the road out curve it in. You know what? Something, something more like that. I have a little curve to it. Right about there. Oops. Always forget they're in the same menu. Alright. So do I just connect it up like that or do I do a little curve? A little curve seems to work. Just like that. And these can be straight because they're pretty close to each other. Let's curve that too much. Hmm. If I do like a double thing. Oh wait, shit. <laughs> I don't know how to do that. There, that surely won't slow traffic down. Whatsoever. I kind of like it. This is different. Because why not? Now we gotta switch this. As an experiment, I would like to leave this here. For now. Just to see what happens. Because it gives people the opportunity to turn around, and it gives people the opportunity that want to use this road the ability to come down it. God, that is such an ugly thing. Does anybody want to use this over here? Not that I see. Well, either way, it's there for the future whenever we expand. If we expand down this far. Because even though this is a really flat, I enjoy the terrain of the other sides of the map. But this, for the most part, is going to be where I basically have the main chunk of uh, area to make money. See, after that, I don't know what to put here, and I don't know. Don't know what to do. Hey, they still need garbage. Are you not using all people? Why are you only using five? That I don't understand. Why? Bump that up a bit. 110%. We'll spend a bit more money on it. Send out a couple more trucks. Jeez, don't be so cheap on it. This place is working its ass off over here with like 20 trucks. Well, it was. Don't worry about that. And once these get used up, I'm sure the garbage will fall back down again. But I'm not really concerned with that. Should probably add another plant. 
just to bump up that electricity. It's going to start going down. I'm sure I could probably add a much better power plant. But these seem cheap and effective, and I can just plonk them down. Because these are, what, 40 million watts? I'm, I'm guessing that's million watts. For 560 a week, and I have four of them, or five of them, actually, and this is 120 for 9,200. Is it just, like, the same? Hmm. This seems cheaper to put out three for the same up... Uh, for a little less upkeep for the same amount of power as this. So why would I do that? This one, though. That's solar-powered. This is nuclear. 640. Wow. Okay, that would be... I really wouldn't need anything <laughs> if I put that down. Oh, that's a different coal power plant. That's 52. Wait. Oh, that's only 52. Hmm, that is more, though. Or how much? Actually, it's actually, like, the same amount. I might start placing those down next. What is this, though? Data center. Yeah, now we're getting into the, uh... Mods. Solar cover park... Solar power cover parking. You know what? For decoration. You think I should have one of these here? It'd be like parking next to the school, because the school is all, you know, environmentally friendly. And it ups the electricity output a little bit, so why not? I think that looks nice. It draws people to it. Whenever the garbage truck wants to get here eventually. Hopefully, soon. It'd be nice. <laughs> Should I place down one of these in here? Because people are going to die. So if anything, it's just going to help. Yeah, why not? How's the, how's the fire? I mean, how's the police? Eh, it's alright. I guess. <laughs> Could be better. I'm starting to think I really should put a local incineration plant on this side. Because I, even though we have stuff on here, they take forever to work, and they're not even doing their job properly. So even if I have to relocate that again to maybe this side of the map, I will. But I don't want to put it on this side of the water. Because how is the garbage? Yeah, it's not really... It's not doing too great. What are these large things? Recycling center... 1400, that is 960 for 12. It's only 12. Jeez, that seems kind of. Yeah, very, very noisy, inefficient, but it's 100% clean. No pollution. Oh, actually, you know, that wouldn't be so bad around here. Would that change anything? Kinda. You know, that wouldn't be so bad to have, like, right here. That doesn't need any electricity or anything, right? Yeah, it makes its own. Because eventually that'll catch up. Uh, again, I made the mistake. Oh, I guess it does need electricity. I made the mistake of having it that way. Son of a bitch. Relocate it. Actually, hold on. No, better idea. What I was going to do last episode. Do not refund it. Okay, let's relocate it first. Because it is in the way. That's going to cost 9000 I don't want to put it up against the offices, but I want to make it its own thing. You know what? We'll spend the money. Fuck it. I don't care. Look at all the money I got now. It's not a big deal. Put that in its own little thing in the center. So that way, now I can relocate it again. And it's not in the way of anything. And it can turn left or right whenever it leaves. So there we go. 
Do I want to put offices it's on the insides? Probably. Enough to fill it in to get electricity going. Because there's only noise pollution. There's no actual pollution. Which I think is great. Should I water this up? I think I should. Just do the whole thing. This is the money spending episode again. Okay, we'll do that, and then... They are not the most efficient water lines, but hey, it does the job. Do I need to add more? Yes. Yes, I do. What is that? Large water pumping station. 560 a week. How much does this cost? 240. What's the output? 120,000. 300. You know, it might be mathematically the same if you just double it up or something. But hey, you know what? We'll give it a try. Why not? It's a water pumping facility. To get like the closest pixel to it. There. Does look nice actually. Does look nice. So the sewage isn't gonna go down it. Okay, so we have a ton of water availability now. Which is great. You still don't have electricity. You will soon. Don't worry. Garbage trucks are getting sent out, which is great. That's very efficient if I want to just throw it in an area. Not operating. Why aren't you operating now? Yeah, are, you, are you good? i just seen trucks go out, though. Like, what the hell are you talking about not operating? Okay, I'm reading the stats of this as we go. It does get full, but it does empty itself at a slow rate. Which, I mean, really, I'm okay with that. Because this is like a, a in-the-clutch recycling center coming in here for the extra places that don't have it. Because we got one here. It's going to get everything in this section. We got one there. It's going to get everything in this section. This will just pick up the extra little bits. And plus whatever we throw in here, which, you know, shouldn't be much. Although I should make the insides offices. Because I don't think I'm going to be doing much with them. Yeah. This could be like a park section, maybe? Because I don't really know what else I could do. Here, because I will leave this section open. Like a big square rectangle sort of thing. Because for now, let me just build these roads here. That is straight, right? Oh god, it's not going to end up straight because it's on like the weirdest little curve, isn't it? Good enough. Because I do want to just get rid of this. So you have a guideline. Just to make sure it was straight. Because I'm probably going to cut over... here. About there. I'm just gonna make weird little lines for homes. You know, we'll keep the rock there. I like that. We'll keep that rock there. The other rocks probably have to go, but that one's, that one's alright with me. So that'll connect up. Just have little sections going across. And here I think I'll make dense homes again. So you know what? That might just connect up. Because then on the inside we can uh, cut it over. But not connect it up completely. Got to make it look weird, that's all. 
Doesn't have to be exact, but as long as it's something different. Okay, this will be dense. These will be residential along the shoreline. But in the middle. Actually, I might want to keep the road there to carve out. Oh, never mind, because it won't be it won't be even. So it's kind of pointless. This might be like a school area or something again. I think that's what I'll do. Definitely be school. Right about there. Bring that down. And you know what? We'll connect up that to there. Why not? So there could always be some shops in here, which is what I plan to do, actually. Some shops here, schools here, residential here, and then the heavy residential over here. See, it's like, do I want to cut that off with this? Just have it go down and loop? Or do I want to keep it like that? I'm not sure. Okay, here's an idea. I'm going to put offices all the way around this inside section. Because that is kind of weird looking in some spots because of the terrain. Which I should have flattened out beforehand, but I kind of like the little dips and grooves because if it was completely flat, I could see for like an, ult an unlimited money sort of scenario where I was just building nice things. But uh, yeah, when it's like that. I do want to leave a decent gap through here and just have like a school and then some walkways and like I did before but they'll like connect up through and everybody can walk to school you know stuff like that which I think will look nice so I do want to put shops here but I don't want to do it yet until I have a connecting area which might just be the school elementary school availability high school availability university availability is pretty good but elementary isn't. So if I put elementary here, then high school here, that gives us all this room to play with back here, which I think is great. So then I want to definitely put, start putting the shops here. Paint that in. Put the low uh, density shops. Now, maybe since I'm not going to add anything else along this side, I could make this offices, just because I am going to make this road down as well. So let's do that. That's offices. Here I'll probably just leave blank. There's like no point. I don't want to start filling it in here. Possibly. At least, at least for now, right there. Okay, so here's the thing. Why not just fill this all in now with what I want? That way, so I don't have to come back to it later. It'll just build itself. Cut that off right there. Maybe another shop or two right there wouldn't hurt on the other side as it transitions back into... Hold on. As it transitions back into... Uh, normal houses. So what I want to put, I want to put regular houses like right there. Then office that. No, not office that. House that. That's what I wanted. Density house. Right there. A tiny little strip of offices as we finish off our density and then right into low density. Now, what I am going to do, after I paint all this... Oh yeah, see, here's the thing. I may leave that go. Right there. Oops. What am I doing? I want to fill that in. I just like painting it. Because sometimes whenever I do the color picker, the color picker, like the paint bucket, it misses, like, the, the grooves if it's on ter bad terrain. But here it's not. Like I said, we're going to keep that. Hold on, wait, let me get rid of that, because I have an idea for this. Just do that, and leave that open. Right there. 
This can go. Don't care about that whatsoever. I'll paint all this. Up here. This is basically so I can finish this and start decorating the next episode. So I don't have to worry about it. Because here I want homes and homes on the inside. Like that. But... I want a road in here again. Because I don't know if I can. I mean, it might cause a noise problem. So I might take some house. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if a couple people don't like it. I can move out. I'm, I'm going to leave that open there for a bus lane to add in again. Because I don't know if I can add other routes to the same bus thing. Where did I put the bus depot at anyways? Oh yes, right here. Is it possible? See, I can only drag and stuff to move the thing. I can't make another line? Oh, create a new line. Well, I feel stupid. Because I'll probably create a line for here. It's going to start at the school. It's going to pick up some people here. Wait, no, we don't want it to start at the school. We want it to end at the school. Well, there's not going to be many stops in between this, so I guess it's not going to be a huge deal. This is like a small bus line. So we have one here. No. Yes. Here. And then we'll just complete the line. Just a small little thing. Because whenever the houses go in there, that'll fill in. Let's speed this up and see what happens. Oh, I know you need electricity, don't worry. I'm trying to make it work. Hesitant if I can just connect that up right now. Just until I get this sorted. I could always get rid of that. It's not in the way of anything. I sent out a lot of new... A lot of new buses. I hope we didn't get rid of our old... I'm losing track of where my shit's at now, because it's so... crazy. I kept the old line, right? Yes, it did. Okay. Let's see, whereas that one connects that city... Probably and a new stop. Create a new line in here where it connects up to the college. And it goes through there at the same time. Maybe. Maybe. Start it here. Let's go. Back here, and then through... Through this, and then bring it over. And I guess we could just add it. And complete the line. We'll see how that works, you know? If people want to go to work that way, they can. If they don't, then just don't use it. But it's just experimenting with the bus lines, because I've never did this before. So a lot of buses. So I guess we only need one one line. So I guess we could just add houses in here then. It's no big deal. Yep. Let's fill it in with houses. It's nice to see people are moving in already. So hopefully nobody does it down here because they'll be dead. And they'll just be doing like ghost stops for now. Wouldn't hurt to add in a shop every now and again throughout here like I did before along the coast. Like just a little corner shop here and there. And maybe one like at this intersection. 3x3 three three seems to be the decent amount for that. And maybe just like one... 
a few here. I could fill in the gap to uh, the houses. And give something to build off of to bring brings people down as well. Is that all connected up? Can I get rid of that? Well, that's still connected up. But I can get rid of this one. Electricity availability is going down again. Do we need to add more? <laughs> I'm going to have like 20 of these things. Unless we invest in something else. We're going to add in that other power plant that does like 12 more million watts output. So, how's that sewage going? Sewage is not going great. It's starting to go down a bit. So we'll add that up. Let's turn it down to 1 just because my game's starting to get a little crazy with that. Not being able to handle it as well as it should. But yeah, now we got some decent growth in here. And let's just bring this road down. Got a lot done today. Oh, see, do we want to connect this up to here now? You know, that wouldn't hurt. I think that would be cool, too. This seems to be the straight way for that, hopefully. Zoom that in. Hopefully I made it able to go above that quick enough. I don't know how I feel about that. It seems weird. There, we'll do that. And then lift it up. So that'll go over. Right about... There. Right over, and then you can go right over. Bring it down. A little bit of a heavy slope, but, you know, as long as you don't go too fast, nothing will happen. And we'll just do a straight shot right over, connect it up. But yet again, we got to add in a connector. I'll probably do the same one, because I like that one. It's efficient. I know nobody travels this road, but I just... Figured it would be nice. I don't know why those aren't working with the terrain, so we're just gonna get rid of them. Alright, let's get rid of this, and I'm probably gonna have to get rid of some of this. Because it is gonna be a little awkward to have to turn it into that. But as long as these are close to that, I'm not really concerned. That's connected up, that's connected up. A little off, but hey, it's fine. Now this. <laughs> little little worse than I thought it was, but... Let's see if I can just... Do the slightest turn into that. Yeah, that looks nice. Well, It sort of looks similar to what I had to do here, actually. Just not as violent. That's okay. Now we just have to switch all this. Let's go this way. This has to be switched all the way down. I know I'm supposed to do it the other way, but I just wish whenever you did this, there's probably a mod for it, that it would just pick the respective way by default that it's supposed to go, not the way I'm doing it, if that makes sense. And again, we'll leave that there, just to experiment. Because nobody seems to really use it anyway, so if anybody wants to turn around, it should help. How many kids you got going here? Almost 300 already. Almost 1,000, okay. So that university capacity, we're still good on that. For now. Just seems to be a large jump of traffic. Unless these are people moving in. Hopefully. <laughs> I should really start putting in, like, a medical center along the back here. And police station. 
It should be able to... It, it'll reach eventually. Which I'm not too concerned about. And you know what? For fire, we'll just put that. I should probably put one in here, actually. Put one here, and we'll put one down here as well. Right across from the big rock. Oh. Okay, well, I see that mistake I made, so let's get rid of uh, this. We don't need houses there. Eventually those will just fill in before they... I don't think they get deleted, do they? They might just stay there. But the real uh, interesting thing is going to be how this garbage situation is going to go if this ever gets full. Oh, and it's getting close. It is getting close. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Okay, so they're using 19. They're using 22. These... Forget about those at the moment, because once that gets full, they're never going to be used again. This is using 8, but it's getting close to its capacity. Especially because there's going to be more people heading in. Oh man, that just... That just worries me. Do I want to have one little outstretch with an incineration plant if everything goes wrong? No. Because I like how it looks where it just cuts off with everything and it's just like its own section. I know that's there, but... If there's a way I can fix it without having to do that, I will. So I think I accomplished a lot today. We got that connected, that connected, more garbage, hopefully solved. Uh, we've finished this off. We're going to leave this area open to build... You know what this place needs, actually? A park. I did not think of putting a park in. Put, like, a little park. Maybe in here. One on each side, maybe. Wait, that's a big one. Where can I put that at? That might... That might work. Before I leave today. Right there. Do that right there. At least we have some sort of park in there. People would be happy because they always bitch. They're like, there's nothing to do besides walk. But that's let's walk on a park. Makes sense. I actually like how that's... That's nice, though. That's not like a playground park. That's like an actual place where you can sit and relax. But yeah, we got most of this done. Just needs everybody to move in. And I do want to put the airport in there. But next episode is definitely going to be decoration. And we're going to start from the top. If we need to. Like in the corners here. And work our way down. Just work our way through this side. And then once we get done with that. Everything should be filled in here. And then we can start working on this. Then we can call this section complete. And we can move. As long as there's no garbage problems along the way. And we can move on to another section on the map and we can see how that goes I don't know where if you here here's the thing if you want to pick a section you want me to work on after I complete this it might take a couple episodes to decorate but the only thing I want to do for sure is put an airport in this figure out some way to do that but yeah anywhere else you see on the map that you want me to do just be like North, northeast corner, northwest corner, southwest corner, southeast corner. Nowhere, because you suck. You know, one of those, any, any one of those work, you know. But yeah, I'm done for today, and I'll see you next time.